From a boat on the Peace River, it's difficult to grasp that this is just one part of the Charlotte Harbor Estuarine System, which consists of 11 connected estuaries. The system also includes a watershed that stretches over 4,000 square miles of land in nearly 11 counties. When rain falls on the watershed and drains into the estuaries, it's called stormwater runoff. It could go straight down your driveway into your drainage ditches and your swales and those eventually um, connect to other um, drainage areas that all will end up into an estuary or in a stormwater retention area. With such a long journey, the runoff picks up many harmful pollutants and carries them into the estuaries. Some of the more common ones are fertilizers and pesticides that wash off lawns, pet waste, hazardous waste like paint and other chemicals, and trash. Some of the work that we've done has suggested that the biggest uh, single source of pollution coming into Charlotte Harbor proper is actually uh, a very polluted lake up in Polk County called Lake Hancock. Now that's 100 miles away from uh, Punta Gorda, but it pollutes Charlotte Harbor probably more than the city of Punta Gorda. Pollution from stormwater runoff not only affects the health of the estuaries, but also our own quality of life. For example, if Lemon Bay was to uh, deteriorate dramatically, you wouldn't notice it if you went out in, on your boat in uh, Estero Bay or Pine Island Sound. But down the road, if Lemon Bay was a very important nursery ground for sea trout, it may affect how easy it is for you to catch sea trout in a place like Estero Bay. The best ways to reduce stormwater runoff are to dispose of trash, hazardous waste, and pet waste properly. If you would like more information about estuaries or the Charlotte Harbor National Estuary Program, log on to www.charlotteharbornep.org.